This is NBC Charlotte News at 5.30. We're looking out for you. Well, now at 5.30, concerns for concert goers in Charlotte. An online video threat for an upcoming rap performance is putting safety in the spotlight. Thanks for staying with us. I'm Anjanette Flowers. And I'm Bill McGinty. Thousands of young people are going to go to the Rick Ross concert this Saturday night, but a violent video released on YouTube might be a sign of trouble. Yeah, NBC Charlotte reporter Glenn Counts is live at the Bojangles Coliseum where the concert will take place. Glenn, what's this all about? Well, Angie, uh, the uh, Gangster Disciples are one of the largest street gangs in the country, and they claim that Rick Ross has disrespected them. Now, they say that if the rapper comes here to Charlotte, he might leave in a coffin. Rick Ross is one of the most popular artists in hip-hop. But he's made a few thousand enemies lately. The gangster disciples have a beef with him, and the North Carolina chapter has put out a YouTube video warning him to stay out of Charlotte. We know you're going to be in Charlotte. We're going to be in Charlotte. I think fans should be concerned. I think the parents should be concerned uh, because you never know. Durham Minister Paul Scott is a hip hop journalist who has been highly critical of the violence sparked by rap artists. Hip hop does not represent the real street. The commercial hip hop that Rick Ross promotes represents Wall Street. And Wall Street cares nothing about the loss of human life if they can make a dollar. In a statement, Charlotte police say they will be prepared, and Dion Cole, who's the assistant programming director for Power 98, agrees. It's going to be definitely a great show. I think it's going to be, you have no worries at all about safety issues or anything like that. I think people are going to come out there, they're going to enjoy it. Still, Scott says he would not let his kids go. No one took the Tupac Shakur notorious B.I.G. Back in the 90s, seriously, until they were both dead. Well, Cole thinks that uh, the disciples and Rick Ross will eventually work out their differences. He just can't imagine something happening here on Saturday night. As far as ticket sales are concerned, it's too early to tell if there's been any kind of effect because officials here say most of these tickets probably won't be sold until very late, either Friday or Saturday. Live from Bojangles Coliseum, Glen Counts, NBC Charlotte. Glenn, thank you very much.